welcome back to my channel. So today we have a juicy, juicy, I don't know what this is, but we got some juice. We got some tea today in our video. Someone sure isn't going to be happy about this video, but it needs to be made. Okay, so obviously this video is about Fashion Nova and the Cardi B collection. So I actually got invited to the Fashion Nova Cardi B um, launch party and it was amazing. We got to see Cardi. I love Cardi. Like, Fashion Nova, you know, I canceled them a long time ago for reasons that I never mentioned to y'all. And then I'm re-canceling them again after this situation that I'm going to have to tell you about. So you know, Cardi B mentions Fashion Nova in all her videos, in her songs. Fashion Nova fan. And they did a collaboration and she made her own clothing line with them, which is great. And I was excited too. And you know, I was like, you know what? Even though I already canceled Fashion Nova, I'll also do this video and I'm gonna buy her collection and do a haul for you guys. So the day that it launched, they launched it while we were at the launch party. So everything sold out and I didn't get anything. And then it came back out again. Plus it was on sale for like Black Friday or Thanksgiving or some some sale. So I went ham and I bought so many items. I bought over 30 items, like almost the whole collection. I just left out some things that I knew I would never wear. But the majority of it, I liked. And I was like, okay, okay, we can do photo shoots in this stuff. So therefore, bought like 30 items, whatever. You know, I tweeted about it. And I told everybody that I tweeted and I can't wait to make the video, blah, blah, blah. And, you know. Three weeks later, still nothing. Haven't gotten an order confirmation or anything. And then somebody uh, comments on my picture on Instagram and was like, hey, are you still going to um, do your Fashion Nova Cardi B haul? And I was like, they didn't tag Fashion Nova or anything either. And I was just like, you know I would, but I still haven't received my stuff yet, three weeks later. And they were like, dang. And I screenshot that and posted that on my stories. Didn't tag anybody, okay? I said that it's been weeks and that I don't even wanna make the video anymore. Because honestly, I didn't wanna make the video anymore. And then, all of a sudden, I get a DM from Fashion Nova and they're like, actually, I'm gonna read it to you because I don't even remember. How'd you even know? How'd you DM me? What, like what? Anyway, they said, I am sorry to hear you are having trouble with your order. May I please further May I please have your order number so we can further assist you with the heart? I was like, kind of, well, very upsetting because it's too late to even do a video now. No one wants to even see it this late. Gave him my order number. And I was like, especially for somebody that spent over $1,000. Because my order came out to 1300 and something. This is all that I bought. I bought all of this for a video. I didn't need to spend my money for that. So I get a phone call from Fashion Nova, blah, blah, blah. They're like, your order is being picked right now. So that means like pick in the items from the warehouse and then they're gonna ship it soon. Okay, and they're like, yeah, so we've been wanting to work with you and we don't wanna ruin your, we don't wanna ruin our, uh, we don't wanna ruin any connections with you. And I'm like, okay. And then they're like, and if you want, we can give you a $50 gift card. Like. All I want is my order. And then we get off the phone, bam, next day, email, your order has been shipped. Oh, so because I have followers, y'all are gonna ship my order out. But I got tons of DMs from regular customers saying they haven't gotten their orders either. But of course they shipped mine because they didn't want any problems with me. They gave me like overnight shipping because they felt bad. So I got it the next day. This is the bag I get. And I'm like, this is a big bag, but this isn't 30 items big of a bag, you know? Open it up, look at the packaging slip. I'm counting everything and I'm like, this is 13 items. Where's the rest of my items? Oh, and I forgot to tell y'all. They told me on the phone that all of my order was going to be shipped and only three items were out of stock so they were going to refund me the three items. Only three. Okay? I only got refunded for one jacket. Just one. So I emailed customer service and I was like, where's the refund for the other three? For the other two? Before I got this. I saw that it was only 13 items. Then I emailed again and I was like, where's the rest of my order? Is there another bag coming that I missed? Like, am I waiting for another bag? And then she was like, hold up. 
they asked for a picture of my my they asked for a picture of the packaging slip this has one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen that's, that's all that was in my bag is what's on that so i emailed the same email that i was already emailing about my order asking if there was another bag you know because like i didn't think anything i was just like oh is there another bag out on its way that i was just waiting for she emailed me back do you mind sending me a photo of your packaging slip yeah you've only been refunded for the whatever jacket whatever However, I will issue a refund for all of the missing items. Hold up. Hold up. You're going to issue me a refund? You, you didn't even send me half of my order? And then now instead of sending me it, you're going to issue me a refund because I'm guessing it's not in stock and you didn't want to say that. Interesting. I tallied up all of this right here, what I did get. 300 and something dollars of stuff is what I got. And I ordered $1,300 worth of clothes. They didn't even give me half of my order. Where's the $1,000? So basically I'm thankful that they're gonna refund me my money. Well, I hope they're gonna refund me my money because I've only seen $53 go back to my bank account. Still waiting for the other $950. Where's that at? It sucks because I really do like Cardi. And that's the reason why I got this stuff. I'll still show y'all what I got, but I had to tell you guys that story before I even got into that. Just so y'all know, if you're gonna buy something from them, expect this, so I don't recommend it. I used to make so many videos for them and they never paid me. They just sent me free clothes and this was before I even had a million subscribers. So therefore I was like, yeah, I'll do it. I get clothes, you know? And then later on, they were trying to do the same thing when I was getting closer to a million. I was like, I'm not doing this for free anymore. They are very cheap with influencers. Yeah, so I'm just hoping that I get my money back and I'll be waiting for it. You didn't want to ruin any relationship that you already ruined before and you ruined it even more. Congratulations. So now that I told y'all a little story, I'll go ahead and show y'all which items I picked up, which items I even got, you know? I don't even know what's in there. Let's find out together. Okay, so I'm just gonna try on the outfits that I did get. This is one of the dresses. It is straight stunting midi, midi dress. This is $39.99. It's very see-through when I go up close. Well, I'm wearing a black bra and black underwear right now. But um, this dress is really cute. Like, I like the material, it's shiny. I like this little, my neck and the sleeves like it's very cute god dang I'm ashy much better my underwear literally say pink on them and you can see that but um I was expecting that I just didn't feel like changing for this video especially because I didn't even get my whole order so why change my underwear and bra if I didn't even get my whole order you know but yeah so number one now I'm gonna put on another one Oh, and then I also got this in black, size small too. I'm going to go ahead and put that on real quick. Oh my goodness, this black one is way tighter. I can't get it on. What the heck? Ow! I don't even think I can put this on. Oh my gosh. Like, this is the exact same dress. Got it in the exact same size. I couldn't even put this on. I don't even know how I'm gonna be able to take it off. Y'all heard me struggling over there? Like I barely got, it's cute. It's very nice. But I'm out of breath. That shouldn't, that shouldn't be a thing. I don't know. Maybe this is an X, it says small. They must have misprinted it or something because this definitely fits way tighter. It's tighter. like. Yeah, it feels like an extra small, man. I can't wear it. I know I'm tiny. I can't wear an extra small, though. Okay, so this right here is the Party Like a Rockstar set. It is $59.99. It's pretty cool. The material's weird. It's kind of like rubbery, plasticky, but then it feels soft. It looks cute. Like, I could wear this. You know? 
I like high-waisted pants that are bigger here because it looks like I got little hips. You know what I'm saying? Top fits good. It's got a zipper in the back. <sighs> Y'all, I like strain my neck I'm trying to get that black dress off. Okay, this is the okra, okra, okra top. Um, it's $39.99. I got this one in an extra small because I knew it was supposed to be like big. It's a top. I don't have pants on, but probably wear it with pants because it's so short. But it could be worn as a dress because it's long in the front and back, you know? The colors are cute. I like the color scheme of this. So that's why I picked this. It's great. Material's nice. You know, it really sucks that Fashion Nova had to F up my order because stuff's kind of cute. So this right here is the She Bad Maxi Dress, $79.99. This would be super dope for a photo shoot, that's why I got it. Like, it looks cool. Like, I would never wear this out, but for a photo shoot, I would. I just fixed the brightness because I feel like this brown was like not being or making y'all not be able to see it correctly but yeah this is pretty cool and then it has the belt i like when maxi dresses or something like that has a belt because i'm so tiny i feel like it'll just drown me and then it won't look cute if it looks like a rectangle this little strap is too big though i would need to fix it it keeps falling but no like honestly this is super cool i'm a gothic princess Dang. This right here is the backing it up dress, and it is $44.99. Um, I love these kind of sleeves on dresses. Just reminds me of back in the day. But the color scheme is cute. These, these, and then it actually is different in the back. Boom, boom. And then it actually has a button, two buttons, and then a little hole in the back. I only buttoned one of them because I was lazy. And you know, I only got part of an order, so. Why button the whole thing, you know? It's not like my favorite, but a nice photo shoot with like one of these colors as a backdrop. Bam, 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 you know? Okay, so this is the next outfit. Um, this is the hard to read bodysuit, it's $17.99. These pants are the emotional gangster trousers. They're $39.99. They're like the same material as that. I got a small in them. They fit. I feel like an extra small would have fit better. Like it would have been tighter. Like they're not big on me. They're supposed to be big. But I just feel like an extra small would have been probably cuter. Like it would have snatched a little bit more, you know? You can see my bra, but <laughs> why am I going to change my bra? I didn't get all my order. Okay. See now, these are the black ones, size small too, and they're big on me, like, like I have space right here. This is the I Like It bodysuit. In small, it's $19.99. Fashion Nova needs to learn how to make um, their necks for turtlenecks a little bit bigger because this would not go over my ponytail or my big head. Now my hair is messed up, but it's okay. I'm not gonna fix it, you know why? I bet y'all know why. The mesh um, bodysuit's cute. These pants are big. Like, look at that. Okay, so this is the money bag bodysuit. This top is actually very dope. I like it. I like the little zippers on the side. This little fluff right here. This right here is out of wire, so it stays up like this. I love this. And then, like, this half is leather or faux leather, and then this half is material. The bodysuit part for whenever you put pants on, whatever. It's so cute. I didn't feel like putting pants on. Y'all know why. So I'm just gonna show y'all this. Like it's very cute. Like this stuff is actually fire. Like this is probably like the best stuff they've had on their site ever. Okay, this right here is the Now I'm a Boss jacket. $59.99. What size is this? This is an extra small, it's huge. See the thing is, this would have been so cute if they sent my whole order. Because on the site, it's supposed to be this, matching pants, that little blue turtleneck that I had, the mesh one, but in yellow, and that's a set. Obviously, I didn't even get one of the sets. There's that. This by itself is not even cute. Like, what are you wearing, Jasmine? Like, why would I want this jacket on its own? And then finally, this is the last item. 
This is the Boss Mood Motto Jacket. $99.99, size small, huge, smells disgusting, honestly. Like, I thought this was cute. This is, like, not cute for $100. What the heck? So, this right here ain't cute. They look like a box. They look like, I'm such a boy, you know, I love it. You know, Kanye <coughs> in their big old jackets. I'm a I like the, uh. I'm a it uh I like the it uh it smells so bad. Like it smells like stank rubber, but stank and musty. I got hold on, I got hold up. I need my clothes. It all went good to the end. The end it went bad. Trying on clothes is hard. But anyway, like I said, I mean everything else was dope. The last things or where it went bad, you know. Congratulations to Cardi, she's amazing. Fashion Nova. <laughs> yep, and that's pretty much the tea on Fashion Nova and the collab that they did. So if you want, I mean the clothes is nice. If you want to risk it, I mean go ahead, but I don't know if you want to risk that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.